Hey, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install KTM power parts or Barkbuster handguards on the KTM 390 Adventure. You will need these tools, a 5mm hex, a 10mm wrench, an 8mm socket wrench, and a regular Phillips screwdriver I'm going to show you here. Start by removing the OEM plastic handguard. For the handlebar mount, use the 8mm socket. Remove both bolts and the clamp. And then remove the grip bolt using the 5mm hex. In the new kit, find the handlebar clamp. In the KTM clamps will have letters on them showing which side of the bite they are for. Using the hex wrench, that will be your primary tool for the rest of the process. Remove one bolt and loosen the other. If you have the KTM kit, attach the plastic shims to the inside of the clamp. The Barkbusters 84 kit comes with a different size clamp and doesn't require them. You don't need to press them into hard, no matter what, they will move when you put the clamp on the handlebar. Just making sure that they don't fall off is enough for now. Now attach the connector to the clamp. Use the M6 cap head bolt and then M6 nut to attach the connector to the clamp. You'll need the 10mm wrench to hold the nut, and this is the only thing that wrench is needed for. Don't tighten it yet. Make sure you choose the correct connector for the side you're working on. Take the connector and turn it with a thin arm looking toward yourself. The right side connector will have a notched corner on the left. The left side connector will have a notched corner on the right. Find the correct handguard bar for the side you're working on. The bar's grip end should look up when you lay it on the flat surface in the correct orientation. Take the round head bolt and use it to attach the inside of the bar to the connector. Again, don't tighten it. The whole assembly should be able to rotate around its connection points while you installed it on the bike. The hardware used for the grip mount is slightly different between the KTM kit and the Barkbusters 84 kit. You'll have a round spacer in both kits, but the bolts will be different. The KTM kit here uses a cap head bolt with a washer, while Barkbusters has a flat head bolt with no washers. Insert the bolt and the washer in the bar, then put the spacer between the bar and the grip and screw the bolts all the way in. Again, leave it a bit loose. Position the clamp on the handlebar, making sure not to pinch any cables, with the connector side looking down. Take the second clamp bolt and screw it back in. Then go back to the grip mount and tighten the bolt. Hold the bar in the correct position so that the lever and the bar are in the same plane while you are tightening the bolt. Now you will need to tighten all the bolts on the other mount. Start with the handlebar clamp. This part is tricky with the KTM kit since the rubber shim will try to slide toward the center of the bike as you are tightening the bolts. To prevent that, before you start tightening the bolts, move the shims so that they pick a little bit from under the clamp on the outside. This way the clamp's edge will hold them in place. Move from one bolt to the other and back to apply even pressure on both sides. The next bolt to tighten is the one that holds the bar to the connector.
Finally, tighten the bolt and nut attaching the connector to the clamp. Take the cover and clip it on the bore, lining up the holes for the screws. Attach the cover to the bore with a pair of little black screws. If you like this video and would like to see my future 390 adventure videos, please subscribe below.